Hey guys, Daniel here with Dark Edge at the Elite Motion Experience at South by Southwest Interactive. And we're here checking out the Elite Motion, which is shipping out on May 14th for $80. Now, the device has got a lot of press over the past couple of months, mainly because it's new and it's a new technology. Now, what you see here is the real deal. This is what's shipping out to all the customers on May 14th. And it's, summing it up, it's actually really cool. Um, they had a couple of games and some apps showing off what it could do. Um, one of them was, of course, Fruit Ninja, which goes without saying, you know, it shows off what it can do. Um, but I didn't really think that was a good game for it really because the Elite Motion is actually super sensitive. Any movement that you do with your finger will detect, will be detected. So you'll sometimes, most of the time actually, not even get a full combo because you're shaking like crazy unless you have a super stable finger. Um, a cool one was this fish game where you're underwater and you can control some lights depending on how many fingers you have on screen. You can control them. Um, or their rockets, I'm not really sure. And you can move them back and forth in 3D space in the ocean and just and just interact sort of with the fish. And that just really, you know, gives you a whole new playing field there to work with. And they also had um, a couple of other games. And then they had a visualizer and also some core apps that show off um, what the Elite Motion is doing. And, you know, it, sh it shows how it detects the fingers. Um, you can do circles and it'll, you know, detect the shape and stuff, which is really neat. What's really exciting is really how developers are going to use this. Because, of course, without developers and without games, this, this would be pointless. And it's just going to be really cool to see specific games and apps for this. Um, one of the questions that I had before this is, will your fingers or hand get tired after using it or even after a couple of minutes you're using it and surprisingly no I used it for a, a good amount about 10 minutes um, and I didn't get tired I mean because you're not really holding your hand up against the screen and making force on a screen or holding your hand up at full length you're, you're just hovering your hand over the device and just slightly moving it so I'm pretty sure you can get you know 15 minutes 20 minutes without it actually hurting your hand you know you'll get tired I guess but it's not gonna hurt your hand or or bother you too much um, but I'm really excited for this I'm really looking forward to when they ship the device out um, and yeah